Ladies and gentlemen, what you have here is a fail. Epically fail. So we got Sergeant Cotton right here driving a forklift. Man, boy, just go ahead and keep Has going. a 463L pallet on a floor. I can get out of here once you get the No, you can't get out of here. And now he has finagled himself inside the building and we're wondering how he's going to get out of here. Stay tuned. IPE presents Real Men of Genius. Real Men of Genius. Today we salute you. Mr. 463L Picker Up A Guy Mr. 463L Picker Up A Guy You broke every Air Force safety rule Oh, I'm a rule breaker You managed to get stuck Carrying a 463L pack And now, you are driving and can't see Watch out before I run you over After all of your buffoonery You finally did something right You got a spotter I feel like Stevie Wonder cause I can't see now you must get the pallet down. Will you throw caution to the wind and not use safety gloves? Safety gloves? Who needs them? Ouch! That goes my finger! Because of your outside way of doing business, we now have to fill out a safety mishap. Doc, can you help me please? So practice operation risk management and always think safety first. Mr. 463L Picker Up A Guy Okay, you guys, we're here today with uh, Sergeant Cotton. He's going to give his take on uh, exactly what happened with this epic fail. So on you, Sergeant Cotton. I was told to get a 64-3L pallet. We don't have a 10K, so I took it for myself to step up to the plate and get it done. I got it done, brought the pallet over here. I didn't need any. I only did it by myself, picked it up. They need no help. And you you can't you come help me. Please, please. I need some help pick this pallet. No. I went over there, thought of a plan, and executed and brought the pallet over. So expeditiously. So what do you think about the the fail on the way over? That was, was no definitely an epic fail. A fail would have been it falling over and hitting the car. That didn't happen. But what did happen is you broke... How many rules did you think you broke on the way over here? I wouldn't call it rule breaking. I would call it getting the mission done by any means. I'm like, um, we're AFSOC. We got to get it done. I did the AFSOC way. Okay? So, uh, just, just real quick, can you tell me how many rules he actually broke? Every major safety violation there is in AFSOC. Sergeant Cotton managed to break them all. I just, I did it the AFSOC way. I True. got the job True. done. True. He did do it the AFSOC way. And that's the problem I have with AFSOC. They forget the Air Force way. So, guys, just in closing, bringing a 4630 pallet on a 6K is wrong. I don't care how you get it done, it's wrong. This guy right here. Take a look at it. Real men of genius. Signing off.